Yeah. So, so that I mean, that's a really interesting kind of statement, and and it's it's good that you point that out. So, so what has been done in the past is uh, they've used like two techniques uh, and and applied them to the same people. So, a classic example since since you brought up the the Harvard people, the nurses study that's done by by the Harvard Nutritional Epidemiology Group is uh, a classic case where they use food frequency questionnaires, but they've also done four uh, 24-hour recalls on the same population, or or it may even have been diaries. Uh, And what they say is that uh, when we compare those, the correlation coefficient between the two is somewhere between 0.4 and 0.7. And therefore, there's a trend for uh, when somebody says something on the uh, food frequency questionnaire, it's also there in the diaries, and therefore these are validated against each other. But I mean, it's it's you know, it's it's not really a, a good validation because they're both somehow tainted by the same problems. You know, 